Hey, partner. You ready to win some tag team gold? <laughs> partner? I'm your partner now? Wait, what have you been out of shape about now? We've won our match, and now we've got a title opportunity. Which sure is great. I guess I just didn't realize that our team was the dark horse and the show horse. What the hell is that supposed to mean? It means you spent our whole match out there hogging the spotlight instead of working as a team. I did what was necessary to win. If that's a problem for you? No, no problem. I just see you, Cody. I see you. What you need to see is that our next opponents are the SmackDown Tag Team Champions, and they are not going down without a fight. Don't worry. I'm focused. My eyes are most definitely on the prize. Good. Then maybe the next time we see each other in an airport, we'll be carrying heavier bags. The following contest is a tag team match set for one fall and is for the SmackDown Tag Team Championship. Introducing the challengers at a combined weight of 432 pounds, the real deal, Jay Moore and Cody Rhodes. And their opponents at a combined weight of 458 pounds, the SmackDown Tag Team Champions, Butch and Ridge Holland, the brawling Brutes. Going into a tag team title match, it's very rare that you feel like the champions are the underdogs, but I think that's the case tonight. You might be right. It is going to be hard to take down two world champions. No way. The Dark Horse and Cody Rhodes are going to be fighting at the Royal Rumble, and I bet they'll get into a fight tonight. You can't beat the real tag team chemistry of our SmackDown Tag Team Champion. Ugh. Boom, Butch with a timely counter. Able to get the advantage here. One response after another, back and forth we go. Oh my goodness, that might have snapped a finger. Some of the most wicked looking offense you'll see. The damage caused there can't be underestimated. Into a chop block. Vicious right forearm. Drops down and delivers a right. The hit's adding up a little on the champ. Yeah, that smash mouth style of Cody's coming to the service. Fought off with an elbow. These two battling to a dead heat with these reversals. He moved, but can he capitalize? Springboard off, tagged in. Oh. Uh-oh, this is just vicious. Oh, stop. his partner in now. Oh, running elbow drop <laughs> on target. Lights out, DDT connects. Just mounted with punches and not, oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Hits him with the counter. Section. Butch was waiting for it. The check and it worked over here. Not what you want to see by any means. The opponent driven down with the door buster. Roundhouse kick. That was nasty. Tag made. The champ taking command. The pedigree! Into the pin attempt. He forces a break before the count of two. He's not letting fatigue set in or get the better of him. Oh. 
Cody Rhodes has his opponent right where he wants it. Nails the crossroads. The champ's eyes look glazed over. Cover. Two. New champ. No, it's not over. This is complete insanity. Still holding on to the title by the skin of their teeth. It looks like Cody is going to have to readjust, maybe strategize here. He thought that was it, but somehow it wasn't. Unloading. And look at that, Saxton. He's running away. Springboard. Stiff punch. Oh, Ridge caught by the counter. That'll rearrange the spine. Ridge gets held in check there. And now thrown back into the ring. Tags him in. and hoisting up their opponent. And down with a DDT. Cover! Wait, 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 how can that be fair? Come on, ref, keep these guys in check. Holland able to counter. Ooh, kick to the face. Holland's losing any command of this match. Perhaps Woods needs to go back to the drawing board. Snake eyes! Good night. Taking their opponent all the way up with the Canadian right into a DDT. I think the champ's got it. Looking for the victory. champion and the world heavyweight champion are on a collision course for the royal rumble but now they are smackdown tag team champions together that's going to be a lot of hardware for them to carry around more importantly this is an alliance that could explode at any moment miz is a genius the WWE Universe definitely approves of the new tag champs. Why wouldn't they? It's not too often you see this kind of star power in the ring at the same time, let alone on the same team. Do it. Hit him. You know you want to. Who are you talking to, Corey? Both of them. I can't stand either one of these guys. These men are now the SmackDown Tag Team Champions, and they're on shaky ground at best. Champ, how you feeling? Much to my surprise, I'm feeling great. I thought Miz was out of his mind teaming us up, but it's worked out pretty damn good. Cheers to that. Another lucky break. Another lucky break. Even when you dole out compliments, you manage to make them patronizing. The word lucky triggers you? I've just been hearing it for a long time. Because you got lucky beating me for the WWE Universal title. All right. Gloves off, here we go. What would you call it? I had you beat when Roman came in. It's been more than two years, Cody. You, Reigns, Miz, all of you keep talking fluke like I haven't been beating everybody who comes at me. You haven't beaten me. Not until the Rumble, partner. We'll see. For now, we have one more title defense before then. See if you can keep your ego in check long enough that we can win the damn match.
Look at all that gold at ringside. The Dark Horse and the American Nightmare seem unbeatable. Not so fast, Saxton. I've heard rumors that the champions have had backstage issues, and typically those types of things spill over into the ring. Well, we'll have to see how that plays out here tonight. Look at this rush of strikes just battering their opponent. An endless bombardment from the champion. The challenger has to be rocked all the way over. Was coming. Oh, what a kick! And again to the back of the head. Driving a forearm into the jaw. Good night. The champ tags. Cody refused it. He's walking out on his partner. Things are getting very interesting as we head toward the Rumble. I'd say so. This just became a handicap match. Like a brick wall running into you. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Chad Gable with the tag. Clothesline! Oh, that'll leave a mark. Caught with a clothesline. Dominating shoulder tackle. What are we about to see? Who won the race? Charlie's horse. Every strike more devastating than the last. Uh-oh, uh-oh. All the way up. And got the sit up, and there's the power bomb. The title up for grabs. The champ is no problem displaying all their power. Complete shot. The challenger is not in a great place. This is when you have to take advantage of tag team rules and get yourself some breathing room. No good reason to stay in this right now. Exploder suplex! Otis running into some trouble here. Any of Otis's defenses have been pegged. What a clothesline! Return fire from Gable. And that might be the start of the momentum swing Chad needed. Time for Gable to take advantage of a misstep and take command. The champion just teed off. Our challenger found no way to break free there. Oh my gosh, with one hand. I'll just leave it at this. Nobody comes into a match hoping to get chucked around like that. Well scattered reversal there. Prime opportunity now for him to get some separation and gather himself. Gable clearly ready and willing to bring the fight to him. No mercy being shown to Gable here. This is Chad's perseverance getting tested. Who won the race? Charlie's horse. The challenger's hopes are slipping away. I don't want to say he's done, but I can hear the fat lady warming up. Now is the time for Chad Gable to find a way to shift into that extra gear. He follows with a sliding elbow. Chad's face is looking terrible. Elusiveness from Gable. What are you guys thinking? Obviously not about the ref's count, Cole. Really pushing the limit there. As long as you're aware, use as much of the ref's count as you want. Into a powerbomb. When the champ wants to prove a point, nothing does it like a powerbomb. He just isn't being given any room to recuperate. Yeah, every attempt to fight back's being negated. Ooh. Oh! Sizing up their opponent, picking the right moment to strike. He's turning the tables. Gable might be waking up. Could be the table turner Chad desperately needed. Nice amateur takedown. All the way over. This is not... Uh-oh. Uses an elbow to disrupt that attack. Whatever you can do, I can do better. Counters on top of counters. Boom! Into a DDT. And shoulders are down. A little closer to getting the pinfall there, but this is still anybody's fight. Clean tag for his partner. Oh, man, like getting hit by a brick wall. Hit. 
Jaw shattering boot. Guys, I have a feeling someone is about to get their chest caved in. I think it's happening. Otis was just a step slow. Oh, right in the mat, face first. That certainly wasn't pretty. That competitive streak of the Alpha Academy met in equal measure there. Oh, punch to the gut. I'll take the wind right out of you. Otis with the reversal. Oh, switches it into a reverse DDT. Come on, count along if you want. The 10 beats of the bottom. Shot after shot after shot. What a counter. Close line. Off with their head. Short jab. It's raining down those shots to the back of the neck. That's just a beat down. He's with the championship on the line. Shoulder up even before a one count. I'm having a hard time believing that one. Pulled back into the hip toss. The challenger not looking good right now. Yeah, they stuck it out through this match, but it wouldn't hurt to go for the tag soon here. And a reversal by Otis. Assaulting the knee with purpose. can tell he's feeling it now. This fight is pumping him up. Suplex! In off the tag. No way! Oh, no! Really thought that was gonna work, but now we got a human being we have to scrape off the floor. Suplex from the for another, and why not? Let's get a trifecta. We can have a new champion. Makes the cover. He's on the ropes. The official sees that it waves off the pen. Textbook fireman's carry takeover. Catches Otis there. Oh, it's going to be interesting. Kick to the midsection. Oh, look at this. Oh, the taxi up. A championship level move. Well, here's the pin to retain. Kicks out. He still has life. I am in shock. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? Setting up neck breaker position. Continuing to work on the arm with a, and a carefully measured knee drop. Oh, look at the well-placed elbow right on the mark. Fighting back by the counter. Chad Gable with the tag. 
Oh, man, he is more than fired up right now. Cross the shoulders into a sit-down axe driver. And he's already taken more hits up there than he should have to handle. Uh-oh, ankle pick. Beautiful takedown. Oh, knee crusher. That's going to hurt. We've seen that look before. Gable's in position. Arm ringer. Ooh, what? wasn't expecting that. Just battering their opponent. Oh, what a super kick, a double super kick. Pinning down their opponent's arm. Driving a knee into the arm. Max Handle finds the mark. He slides him back to the mat. Kick to the gut. I have a theory what's coming next. Ataxia. Another one bites the dust to the champ. There's two. He kicked out at two. And look at the disbelief on the face of the champion. They both know what's at stake. Neither competitor is going to lose easy here. How draining was that? Can it be done again? Can that maneuver be summoned at least one more time? Lights out! Pop up! Power bomb! And Gable's hopes are waning in this one. You gotta wonder, what does this do to Gable's confidence? Face first into a DDT. The champion into the cover! And the champs stay the champs. What a title defense. Here is your winner. And still, the real deal, Jay Moore. Despite Cody Rhodes leaving the WWE Universal Champion high and dry, the Dark Horse is standing tall. Where the hell is Miz? Ah, uh... uh... Miz is at a very important... He hightailed it as soon as Cody jumped off that apron, didn't he? Have you checked your social media? People love the drama between you and Cody. Besides, you guys can fix things up before your next match. There's not going to be a next match because I have had enough of that sanctimonious, entitled SOB. Our run as a team, it is over. So you can have your tag team championship back because I am done. Miz is not going to be happy. I don't care. When I beat Cody Rhodes for the heavyweight title at the Royal Rumble, I'll be able to go to any brand I want, any time I want. Miz's control over my career will be finished once and for all. Huh, your boss is really not gonna be happy about that.